Alright, today I'm fighting Elden Tista, who has been busy moving and has a very actually scary team because he has Trick Room and a bunch of mons that are slower than anything I possess. My slowest mon is basically Machamp. Pharisee does not count. Machamp is like 55 base. He has a Scavalier, Reuniclus, Snorlax, uh... Yeah, it's, it's a lot. Um... His fast mode is based around Slurpuff. I kind of think he's going to hard trick room. In DD, Reuniclus is almost guaranteed to get it up and is very, very complicated. Um, I'm bringing Specs Jolteon, especially defensive Togetic, a Life Orb Rotom, Machamp, as always, and a Screams Dragapult. And I'm interested in what I'm going to see. And good luck, have fun. Alright, Glades here, Charmeleons here, Hard Trick Rooms here. I'm surprised to see, um... Okay, I'm terrified of Snorlax, truth be told. I'm surprised to see, um, Glade. I wonder what it's there for. Maybe it's there for Dragapult. My plan was always going to be to do this, to set up on Rotom with Nasty Plot in the face of Hard Trick Room, and Volt Switch into Togetic. I'm worried about this into Belly Drum Lax. It might just be too much, but we'll find out. I didn't run too many calcs for Belly Drum Lax, which I probably could have. I All I needed to do was put Discharge instead of Thunderbolt on Rotom. With Life Orb and uh, with a Volt Absorb Jolteon, it would go well. I considered it, but decided I didn't need to worry about it and the champ could punch it if worse comes to worse. A Scavalier is destructive into my team. I have no fire types. I don't know what Charmeleon's doing. Alright, good luck, have fun. I wonder if it's Scarf Gallade. I consider it Scarf Gallade, but Scarf Gallade outspeeds everything, including Dragapult. Um, and I decided it wasn't worth investing for, and I have HP in most of my things. In DDS Scavalier. Okay, so it's just going to be straight redirection. I wonder who you target in this scenario from his end. I think I'm actually okay with Thunderbolts. I kind of just want to put down damage and not worry about things right now. Max Stark into Ndidi. I, I didn't expect this lead. I'm not sure what's that's gonna happen. Rotom can survive hits from a Scavalier. Like, Life Orb a Scavalier barely two shots it. The problem is, is I didn't expect a Scavalier to be out running front and I thought I could have a Nasty Claw by the time it would come out. No max. Okay. It's a lot of damage. Good play, good play. It is specs on Jolteon. It's not going to do a lot, yeah. Mm. 
I'm gonna max lining the Escavalier and just put Thunderbolt in Ndidi. Um, if Escavalier protects, I'm setting terrain. Jolteon's just specs damage right now. I'm surprised by this lead. He's gonna stall out my max. He will. Withdraw on Didi. Okay, so Snorlax is eating a Specs electric move. It's probably Belly Drum. Apologies for the crit. That is a very... Is that a Soul Vest? That might honestly be a Salt Vest with how little damage it just took. Oh, I'm gonna lose my electric train as soon as I got it. Well, I have the champ in the back. I haven't run any calcs, but with... There's no way it's... Assault Vest. I'm a champ in the back, which makes me think if I just KO the Ndidi, get the defense drop, I'll be okay. Okay, follow me. Probably drop the Indeedy then. Ah, oh, it lives. That's so close. Special defense drop is relevant though. Goodbye, Jolteon. It is Reuniclus. Protect on Togetic because I'm okay if it goes down. And I'm going to attack into Rena Push just for damage. Like, if Rotom goes down, I'm just bringing in. Um... If Rotom goes down, I'm just bringing in the champ. Knight with redirection, and I think it's over from that point. Good chance Snorlax is just, uh... Uses, like, Steel Spike on Togetic right now. It is especially defensive Togetic.
wonder if it's a nasty plot or recover on a Luna Plus. I'm unsure how to play this. I guess it's gotta be just giving the 1v1 to the champ. I'm worried if Reuniclus has recover though. Survives, love to see it. It's not recover. I need to check how many trick room turns there are and see if I can protect with the chain. Three turns, way too many. Do I stall for guts? Now is the question. Yeah, I think I do. I think stalling for guts is always better. Um, I think Machamp... Okay, love to see it. I think Machamp always was going to survive a singular hit, and I think he wasn't afraid of the road. I mean, he should be afraid of the road. That's a crit. I just want to know if it... Yeah, as long as that doesn't Oko, it's always just, uh, stall for Flame Orb. Okay, turn one worked. Reuniclus off the rip was very interesting to see. He doesn't know it's Nasty Plot Rotom. I could just lead the same and see what happens. I'm down to just bring the same and see what happens. What is his adaptation? What is the Charmeleon doing, though? What is the Charmeleon doing? I love seeing random Pokemon like that. Honestly, I'm a coward for not bringing Pharaoh Seed. I considered it this week. I very much considered it this week. I wonder if the Charmeleon was for Pharaoh Seed. I was very close to bringing Pharisee. But, uh, because Reuniclus 
gets Focus Blast, and a Scavalier gets Fighting Attacks. I got scared off. I just led the exact same. Let's see the adaptation. Okay, it's hard trick room. Hard trick room. I have a plan for this, though. I have the plan I workshopped for this exact lead, and it's just to let Trick Room go up. I can't stop it. You know? Sometimes that's just how it is. Volt Switch bringing Togetic specially defensive setup on Rotom. Both of your mons no discharge. <laughs> yes, if both of my mods no discharge. I, it's funny because I was talking about putting discharge on for purely this earlier. Let's get it raining. Do I need to max this turn? My token took especially defensive. It's gonna take nothing from me, too. I guess it's Psy Shock on Reunicus, so that might not even be true. Okay, I should have maxed this turn. I did not call this. I should have called this. from the media. the turn. Okay. I don't like what happened. I'm gonna double stall. This might just get me another defense drop on Rotom, and it might not be the play. I really did not expect this to be Life Orb. I should have gone with Discharge and Arrogance. Okay. 
okay. That was in the Rotom. It was a double up in the Rotom. Okay. One Trick Room turn down. Two turns to go. I can attack this turn for sure. I'm gonna lose Togetic, I think. Then I can bring the champ out, double protect. Yeah, but the defense drop that KOs. It's also specially defensive, not physically defensive. I don't believe this KOs. Yep. Nasty plot Rotom is third. I did not pay attention last game to the speed tiering between Rotom and, uh, or Machamp and Snorlax, and I really should have. Can Rotom at minus two? I don't believe Rotom at minus two survives. I'm not calcing, but I don't believe Rotom at minus two lives. I believe Nasty Plot Rotom will drop it. It does. Yep, it's AB. Alright, GG well played. GG, well played.